Hey folks, it's Michael Klepik here, your favorite air purification guru. Today, we're shaking things up, literally, as we dive into the wonderful world of bag house cleaning. Whether you're working in heavy industry or just someone who loves clean air and who doesn't, knowing how to properly maintain your bag house filters is key. Trust me, if you ignore it, things can get dusty really fast. Let's get into the nitty gritty of how to keep those filters clean, your air pure, and your operation running smoothly. Importance in industrial processes. Baghouse cleaning might not sound glamorous, but it's crucial for keeping your industrial operation efficient. Dirty filters can clog up faster than you might think, cutting productivity, increasing energy costs, and even damaging equipment. And let's not forget about those strict environmental regulations. Nobody wants to deal with fines for excessive emissions, right? But it's not just about saving money or complying with the law. Regular cleaning ensures that harmful particulates don't escape into the workspace, protecting workers from respiratory risks. So, whether it's safety, efficiency, or plain old cost saving, baghouse filter cleaning is essential to your industrial setup. Baghouse filter bag. Cleaning techniques. Let's talk methods. Cleaning a baghouse filter isn't a one size fits all process. Depending on your system design and the type of dust you're collecting, different methods will be more effective. Here's a rundown of the most common cleaning techniques. Pulse jet cleaning, quick and efficient. This method uses short bursts of compressed air to clean the filter bags. The air is injected through the center of the bag creating a shock wave that dislodges the dust cake from the outside. Pulse jet systems can keep running while cleaning, which means no operational downtime. Cleaning time, fast. Ease of maintenance, high. Operational downtime, none. Mechanical impact, high. Frequent cleaning, but bags can wear out faster. Pulse jet systems are widely used for continuous operations and are perfect for round or flat bag designs like the Blizzard Baghouse Filter RS and Blizzard Baghouse Filter FS. Shaker cleaning, shake off the dust. As the name suggests, this method involves physically shaking the bags to loosen the dust. It can be done manually or with a motorized mechanism. The dust falls into the hopper below and voila, clean bags. Cleaning time, medium to long. Ease of maintenance, medium. Operational downtime may be required. Mechanical impact, medium, less wear and tear than pulse jet, but slower. Shaker systems, like the Vortex Vibro CP, Vortex Vibro OP, and Vortex Vibro Big, are often found in smaller or less continuous operations. Manual cleaning. Hands-on and precise. Sometimes, you just have to roll up your sleeves and get your hands dirty. Manual cleaning involves physically removing dust from the bags. This method is typically reserved for hard to reach areas or when other cleaning methods can't do the job. Cleaning time, lengthy. Ease of maintenance, low, requires skilled operators. Operational downtime, yes, the system needs to be offline. Mechanical impact, depends on the operator. While labor intensive, manual cleaning ensures that no spot is missed. This method is perfect for units like the Vortex Compact when precision is key. Reverse air cleaning. Gentle but effective. In reverse air cleaning, the system sends air in the opposite direction, gently deflating the bag and causing the dust to drop off. It's an excellent choice for delicate materials or more abrasive particulates. Cleaning time. Medium. Ease of maintenance. High. Operational downtime. None. Mechanical impact, gentle, best for long-lasting materials. Reverse air systems are ideal for keeping fragile filter materials in tip-top shape without the heavy wear and tear of other methods. Possible breakdowns and remedies. Even with a stellar cleaning routine, issues can pop up. Here's a quick troubleshooting guide to keep your bag house in shape. Decreased airflow, clogged bags or a full hopper might be the issue. Clean those bags or empty the hopper. Air leaks. If the suction power is down, you might have worn out seals. Replace them ASAP. Dust at the outlet. If there's dust where it shouldn't be, you might have damaged or improperly installed bags. 
Double check your filters and reinstall them correctly. Vibrations or noises. Damaged components could be the culprit. Repair or replace them immediately. And there you have it, folks. A crash course in bag house cleaning that'll keep your filters fresh, your air clean, and your factory running like a well-oiled machine. Whether you're pulsing, shaking, or doing it the old-fashioned manual way, staying on top of filter maintenance is key to a safe and efficient operation. If you're in the market for a new bag house or just need a tune-up on the old one, give us a shout at Torch Air. We'll help you clean out the dust before it turns into a mountain. Until next time, stay clean, stay efficient, and as always, breathe easy.